Well, Dino, fixtures are now out for the 2022-23 campaign. Is it starting to become uh, a little more real that we're going to be back out on the field in a couple of weeks' time? Yeah, definitely. I think when the fixtures are out, it's always a good day to look forward to. And uh, we'll be back there next week and starting pre-season. So uh, we will be good going forward. I think it'd be fair for me to guess that fans probably looked at Boxing Day as a big fixture. The two games against Amphill, they probably would have looked out. But what is the playing group, fixtures-wise, that you look out for going into a new season? I think first game's always a big one and we've got commentary away so it's quite a big game and then obviously Boxing Day here um, is always a big game. You get a sell out crowd and being at Amptill will be a local derby so no, it's always a really good occasion. And in terms of the transition for the season, 28 games we know guaranteed, the cup goes back to in season. How much is that going to help us? Because it was kind of a bit of a weird end to the season. We didn't really know when it, when it was going to end, who we were facing in the cup. Now it's a bit more solid. Is that going to help you building forward next season? Yeah, no, definitely. I think we've got a set fix just now, but we will only look at, at game by game. So we'll go into the first game at Cov. We've got some pre-season fixtures as well. So taking game by game and then we'll go on and it looks in a, an exciting start. So yeah, we'll go from there. A week to go until you meet up for the first time as the 2022-23 squad. Um, how much are you looking forward to that day? I think it's a bit bit more of a fun and games before the pre-season kicks in, but to learn those new faces and all that kind of stuff, how much are you looking forward to it? Yeah, no, really looking forward to it. Missed all the boys. It's been a long, I think it's eight weeks now, isn't it? So, um, yeah, it's been a long time. I'm looking forward to seeing the lads. Uh, hopefully they haven't put on a few extra pounds, but yeah, no, it'll be all right. And uh, it'll be good to see Booge back. I haven't seen him for a little while, so yeah. I know 12 months ago I set you the target to get your 100th try at the club, you managed to achieve that. What are your targets for the 2022-23 campaign? Um, more just keep scoring, helping the team maybe, and there's no set targets, it's all about just team performance, hopefully we can build on what we did last year and try and get into that top, sort of top four positioning.